are interested in the unknown, the mysterious, the unexplainable. That is why you are here. And now for the first time, we are bringing to you the full story of what happened on that fateful day. Today is our last day in Cambodia. We're being picked up by a tuk-tuk. A tuk-tuk that brings us to a bus station. I hope the first bus goes to the border to Thailand and the second bus goes from there to Bangkok. Nine dollars for that, can't complain. We just drove to the border, Cambodian side. The bus dropped us off. We got small little red stickers that identify us as being part of a booked tour, like a booked bus. We got our stickers to, uh, we got our stamps to leave Cambodia and now we walk to the, to the Thai side and check into Thailand. We're back in Bangkok, a good 10 hours on the bus later. Uh, I think it's 6 or 7, no, I think it's 6 p.m. now. We started at 7 a.m. So it's a long day. Everything at the border went pretty smooth, no problem. Yeah, now we're in Bangkok um, and we gotta see where we go tomorrow. By the way, they dropped us off right next to the place where, we, uh, where we've been the first time in Bangkok. So that's perfect. So it's early in the morning here in Bangkok. We, uh, we are on the bus number 53, going to the main train station. Um, we want to catch the train to Suantani. Suantani is the place from where you can go to Phuket. And uh, there's no direct train to Phuket, that's why. We have to change into a bus there. Uh, we don't we don't really know how it works. We just hope we get the 8 a.m. train. train station and we didn't take the train because the train is booked out unfortunately they told us we can come back 10 minutes before the train departs maybe we get a ticket maybe not yeah. just drowning in sweat here it's super hot we're at the food court right now yeah so this is the main hall of the Bangkok train station <laughs> So yeah, it looks like we're gonna hang out here for a while. We have to find another train, maybe the night train, overnight train. That's what happens at 8 o'clock. Uh, yeah, we got tickets, um, pretty unexpected. We. We got some seats for the train we wanted to take, um, which departs in five minutes. We gotta run. Yeah, here we are on the train. It worked. We're pretty happy that we don't have to spend half the day in Bangkok, because the next option would be uh, the sleeping train, which arrives tomorrow morning. But actually, we take the train to see scenery, hopefully. Okay, so we just double checked. We arrive at four, for, uh, like, yeah, 4.45, so that's a good 8-hour train ride. Here's our ticket. Yeah, and as soon as my t-shirt is dry again, I put my jumper on because in this train it's super cold again. We have air conditioning and it's cold. Yeah, it's quite good here in the train food-wise. We just got lunch. 
This is chips, fish chips, not fish and chips, it's fish chips. I still have my breakfast cookies because we ate before we came on the train. And now I got so much food and I'm not hungry at all. We're on the train for a couple of hours now and there are still a couple of hours ahead. And the problem is, for me, it's boring. The ocean is over there, sometimes you can see it, so right now you can't. We're pretty close actually, but I thought about just having a look around here on the train, which might be interesting. First thing, fans up there. based on sworn testimony. Can you prove that it didn't happen? Perhaps on your way home, someone will pass you in the dark, and you will never know it, for they will be from outer space. Thank you for watching The Wonder Dude. Now smash that like button. <laughs>